Every day is a, is a challenge in terms of language and worldview. Um, how do we relate to those people? How do we share the gospel in the context of who they are and uh, how they'll perceive what we're saying? You know, and, and many times we think this is what missionaries do, but it's also what their children do. So as a family, we're going cross-culturally and not just staying for a couple of weeks, we're living that culture. When we came out of that culture, our children had more time that they could remember in that culture than in the American culture. So when these families come back, we're not just switching um, where we live, but we're switching back into a culture that has also changed. So it is a transition. Home is important. Um, identity is, is important in all of this. Furloughing in a regular area for us in the Inland Empire and at Pathway, always over those 26 years, helped uh, us as a family have a sense of normalcy. Uh, the, the kids knew that some things were familiar in Redlands and in the Inland Empire, and, and we did as well. One of the most difficult kinds of houses for missionaries to find to live in is houses that would accommodate a large family. Many of our co-workers have had trouble. Um, in the southeast, there are more guest houses for missionaries to stay. Um, obviously, in California, there aren't as many. Before Pathway had the house, and we wanted Jessica and Andrew to go to Cal Baptist, uh, we had to find housing, and there wasn't much of it in the area. By Pathway having the houses, it gives opportunities for families that want to place their children at Cal Baptist or Gateway Seminary. It gives them an opportunity to be close by. It is required that we come back and that we be able to share what God is doing overseas so that people can, can share with us, uh, first of all, how to pray, and then secondly, um, what God is doing in those places, what, are, what the challenges are, what the victories are, uh, and how we need their uh, support and encouragement, not only financially, but also uh, just in coming alongside. When, when people come back from furloughs, and we talk to the children, and we talk to the adults, if they've had a really good experience on furlough, um, most of the time it's because the church that they came back to integrated them in, their kids made friends, you know, the, the parents made friends, they learned, they grew, um, they came back refreshed um, and renewed.